What the? This nigga said, tell me how I rat and came home to a big bag. I don't condone snitching at all. Okay. Oh shit. Here we go again. Hey, uh -huh. It's your brother, my did it back today with another video, man. Make sure you go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, and turn on that post notification so you can see every time your boy upload a lit ass video. Oh, brother, I know I'm a little late on this, but I'm a regular YouTuber with a regular ass life. You feel me? So I'm gonna be reacting to that snitch now, Google. This nigga broke the internet with this shit. It's at like 130 million views, bro. Like, they say he broke Eminem record. Like, even black people couldn't do that shit. Like, we got Drake. So, I don't know what the fuck and how he did this shit, but it is what it is. I'm going to go ahead and get into this video because I'm late anyway. So, here we go. Let's get into it, man. But, hey. Like y'all know I like ass in my videos, so anything with ass I'm gonna be attracted to, but I don't give a fuck about his lyrics during this video. It's just gonna be ass all in the video. Hey. Let me stop. This nigga is a snitch. I can't do it. See me what you talking about. What you talking about? Last time some niggas seen him, they ended up in jail. And I believe uh, one nigga got life, one nigga got 20, and the rest of them niggas got at least 15. So, yeah, but I, I like the ass in the video, 6 9 But hey, brother, you, um, you did the unbelievable. Ever sees this video, he will beat the shit out of me because he don't get down snitching either. But I ain't gonna lie, this bitch is like, no, bruh. Um, I'm mostly cool with all the females in the video. I have no clue why I like so much ass and titties because that's a problem. <laughs> does not give a damn about what he did. Brett is living his best life knowing that he probably got a price on his head. I think he played this shit out from beginning to end. It's probably, this shit was probably a setup by him the whole fucking time, my nigga. Like, he knew this shit was gonna happen. It's like, I don't understand how. How he get out of jail and this nigga is just on top of the motherfucking world. How the fuck does this shit happen? Who let this shit happen? Hey. Hey. Shit, that means get me, though. Hold up. This gotta be some of his girlfriends because this nigga, I don't understand, like, 
I'm just so confused at how this nigga gets out of jail after snitching and runs up 130 million views and can post up at fucking on balconies and shit with stacks of cash and niggas is just so excited to see it. I, I am so fucking confused. Like, I was born in the wrong time. I'm a 90s baby, so. Hey, yo, Hey, hey, she's getting that shit. She got the shit on his goddamn ankle. What that nigga said? Tell me how I rat and came home to a big bag. This nigga is very disrespectful. This nigga is very motherfucking disrespectful. I, I can't say shit. Like, I can't say shit, boy. This nigga got at least 100 people arrested and tried to snitch on others. And he done put that shit in the song. Hey, this nigga is, is the ultimate troll of all time, brother. I cannot see anybody talk. And I thought 50 Cent was the biggest troll ever. This nigga, Takashi? This nigga up here with that shit. Like, he up here and the rest of the world is down here. Like, this nigga is above everybody. Like... I'm gonna give him his props because he using this shit to his advantage. But God damn, boy. This nigga said, tell me how I rat and came home to a big bag. These bitches fine, though. Hey, 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 hey. Follow 6 9 for a shout out, comment. What'd they say? Like, follow 6 9 for a shout out, comment. Follow 6 9 on Instagram for a shout out, comment when done. This nigga is a troll, bro. Like, I'm so confused at what the fuck I just seen, bro. Like, for all you young niggas who gonna watch this, and if you got it, if you got this far, you might as well follow me on Instagram too. I'm not gonna give you a shout out, but just follow me on Instagram. I ain't got no goddamn followers like that. I'm not six nine. But my biggest shit is just like, if this was in the '90s, bro would have been dead. Early 2000s, been dead. Nigga wouldn't have never made it out of prison. But we also ain't wouldn't have had the coronavirus come through and help the nigga get out of prison. But the shit just confusing. This nigga is living off the hype of him being a snitch. A rat. Fuck. I don't know. Is this nigga like... He might really be untouchable, like he said on The Breakfast Club. Like, that nigga might, might really be untouchable, but hey. If that's what the fuck is going on, then that's what the fuck is going on. It is what it is, brother. I'm just saying. This is the 90s. Should have been dead. But it is what it is. Today's generation will condone anything. Niggas is always going to say they kill us, talk about killing, toting guns, and all that bullshit. But when it come down to it, when they getting that detective's office, they gonna tell everything and come out and act like ain't shit ever happened and ain't shit gonna be done to them. But yet you got niggas like Pop Smoke and out here getting killed. Real niggas getting killed. Niggas fucking, that's crazy. Like, 
Oh, fucking well. I'm just a young nigga on YouTube. It's your boy Lamont Did It. Back today with another banger, man. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on social media at Lamont Did It, Instagram and Twitter. Make sure you turn on your post notifications so you see every time you upload a late ass video. I'm out, bro. Bye. Kids, no snitches will hurt in the making of this video. Bye! Okay!